Auzubillahiminashaytuanirrojim Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Assalamu alaikum Welcome back to my channel Aaj ka jo unit hai hamara wo hai unit number 12 that is hydrocarbons What are hydrocarbons? Hydrocarbons are the simplest type of organic compounds They are composed of carbon and hydrogen Hydro Hydrogen Carbon Hydrocarbons are widely used as fuels. Example of hydrocarbons are diesel, gasoline, natural gas and LPG. Now the LPG stands for liquefied, liquefied petroleum gas. Yes. Hydrocarbons are polar or non-polar. So the hydrocarbons are non-polar. Non-polar covalently bounded compounds. So why they are non-polar? Because they contain carbon and hydrogen atoms. That is why hydrocarbons are non-polar compounds. Now the hydrocarbons are divided into saturated hydrocarbons and unsaturated hydrocarbons. Saturated hydrocarbons are alkanes. Now what is alkane? Alkane is a hydrocarbon that contains only single bond. The general formula of alkane is CnH2n plus 2. N is the number of carbon atoms. Number of carbon atoms. Examples of alkanes are CH4, methane, C2H6, ethane, C3H8, propane, C4H10, butane, C5 H12 pentane. Now, what is cycloalkanes? Alkanes in the shape of ring is called cycloalkanes. General formula of cycloalkane is CnH2n. Alkanes are less reactive and also called as paraffins. Para mean less and affins mean affinity as they are single bond so they are less reactive alkanes and cycloalkanes form a series of compounds called homologous homologous series There is an international standard of naming compounds and that standard is called IUPAC. IUPAC stands for International International Union International Union of Pure and Applied chemistry the parent name of alkane is derived from common system do tarah ke system the common system iupac system now preparation of alkanes how we will prepare alkanes so they can be prepared by the addition reaction of alkenes and alkynes and by reduction of alkyl halides now what is addition reaction reaction in which an atom or group of atoms are added to a compound that has a double bond or triple bond thus this reaction is called addition reaction so the unsaturated compounds that is alkenes and alkynes are associated with addition reaction. 
combine with hydrogen hydrogenation in the presence of nickel and temperature is 250 to 300 degrees C remember whenever we do hydrogenation so we will use the list nickel or platinum and the temperature will be 250 to 300 degree C will give us ethane alkane same here hydrogenation of alkynes alkynes that is ethane or acetylene hydrogen added to acetylene it will give us ethene in the presence of nickel 50 to 300 degree C temperature on further hydrogenation in the presence of nickel 250 to 300 degree C temperature gives us alkane now reduction of alkyl halides alkyl halide combined with nascent hydrogen it will form alkane and hydrogen halide methyl iodide in the presence of nascent hydrogen it will give us methane hydrogen form hydrogen iodide replace with iodine these are the reactions for the preparation of alkanes the hydrogen at the time of its generation is called nascent hydrogen alkanes become dash flammable less flammable when the percentage of carbon in alkane molecules increases alkanes are non-polar so they are insoluble in water because the water is polar so it is insoluble in water but soluble in non polar organic solvents like benzene benzene ether acetone so reactions of alkanes that is called substitution reaction in substitution reaction an atom or a functional group is replaced by a different functional group. Now the reaction of alkanes are the first one is halogenation and the second one is combustion. In halogenation chlorine halogen mean chlorine chlorine bromine iodine halogen the halogens combine with the hydrogen of methane and it will form HCl HCl and methyl chloride CHCl3 is the formula of chloroform commonly called burning then combined with excess of oxygen it will produce heat carbon dioxide and water this is called complete combustion when the methane combined with limited oxygen so incomplete combustion occur it will form carbon monoxide water and carbon that is unburned carbon carbon monoxide is a poisonous gas which creates suffocation and causes death